Ivy from East Bears and in this video I'm going to talk you through how to clean your barbecue ready for those warm summer days. If your barbecue has been stored away during winter, it's probably gathered lots of dust, dirt and may even have some burnt on food left from last year's barbecues. Here are a few steps you can take and products you can use to get your barbecue clean and fired up once again. First, if your barbecue still has some stuck on food from last year's events, turn it on or light some coals and leave it for a few minutes. This will help to soften food as well as the grease and grime. Next, allow your barbecue to cool down so that it's safe to touch, but still warm enough that food and grease are easier to remove. Then remove food, dirt and grime using a wire brush. This will make it much easier to clean. Any wire brush will do the job, but we recommend a multi-use one like this one from OvenMate. As well as the wire, it has a polypropylene brush on the other end, which will come in handy later on and a metal pick tool for getting into those tiny nooks and crannies. Tip away any leftover ash from the base into a bucket as it will collect moisture and be harder to clean if left. Now for the cleaning. Remove the barbecue racks and set them to one side. To clean your barbecue, you can use warm soapy water and a brush or sponge. However, if your barbecue has been left all winter long and is in need of a deep clean, then we recommend using a specific barbecue cleaner. To show you how to do it, I'm going to use our very own East Bears Premium Barbecue Cleaner. First, spray the barbecue cleaner onto your barbecue. Leave to soak for around two minutes for this cleaner, or however long it says on the instructions of the cleaner you're using. Then rub the cleaner in using a brush or scour sponge. You can then remove the solution using a wet cloth and watch the dirt and grime rinse away. Now that your barbecue is sparkling clean, it's time to do the same with the racks. You should be able to clean these by leaving them to soak in a bowl of warm water and washing up liquid. If that doesn't quite do the trick or your racks need a deeper clean, a specific oven or barbecue rack cleaning kit, like this one from OvenMate, will offer a more intense clean. When using these kits, always make sure to use the gloves and protective equipment provided, or use your own to protect your hands and skin. The kits usually come with a cleaning bag to soak the racks in. Carefully place the racks into the bottom corner of the bag, ensuring that you don't puncture it in any way. Next, pour the gel or solution provided into the bag with enough solution to enable the racks to have a complete coating when the bag is flat. Leave the rest to use with the other bag. Before sealing, get as much air as possible out of the bag. Then close the seal and fold it over to make the smallest envelope to ensure all the racks are coated. Leave to soak for two hours or however long it says on the instructions. Be sure to leave the bag in a safe place where it can't be interfered with. For really stubborn dirt and debris, you should leave the racks to soak overnight, but be sure to check the cleaning solution label. When you remove the racks, be sure to wear gloves again. Rinse off any residue from your racks and they will look sparkling clean again. Next, you'll want to give the exterior of your barbecue a wipe down so it's just as clean as the interior. Use a fresh cloth and warm soapy water to wipe down your barbecue and leave it to dry. If your barbecue is stainless steel, we'd recommend using a specific stainless steel cleaner like this one. Spray this onto a cloth and wipe in the direction of the stainless steel grain to maintain the color and shine. A good trick to protect the outside of your barbecue is to give it a light coating of baby oil. This is particularly useful if you're planning to keep it outside all summer. To make future barbecue cleans a whole lot easier, use a hot plate liner next time you fire up your barbecue. Place it on the bottom of your barbecue and it will prevent food and grease from sticking to the surface and keep it clean. After use, the liner can then simply be wiped clean or soaked in warm soapy water. So there you have it our tips to make sure your barbecue is sparkling clean and ready for those warm summer days. For more tips and advice for getting your outdoor areas summer ready, check out our video on our go-to products for outdoor cleaning. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more videos on appliance cleaning, fixing and maintaining. Thanks for watching.